Oh, hi everybody. Thanks for joining me on our first installation of 2014. First thing you'll notice is that the show's name has been changed to my given name, Rolly Sutter's Reviews. That's the way it's going to be from now on. Uh, basically, it just affords me uh, the ability to do reviews on more than just guns, which it, the channel started off in. Uh, knives which we're currently doing. I want to get around to the equipment and, and other things that are, uh, you know, surround uh, our little hobby. And uh, what I have for you here today is the winners of a few little categories that we did have here at the last quarter. And the winner of the small clip knives is the CKRT Drifter. This comes in at around $33 to $39, depending on where you purchase it, and I can guarantee you that this is going to be a knife that is going to last. And uh, I'm not even going to just park it, I'm going to put it into one of my other EDC bags, uh, and uh, it's going to become part of my regular EDC uh, secondary and third carry bags. Great knife, never disappointed. 8CR blade on there, 8CR 14MOV uh, to be exact. Excellent little knife, I'll cover it in the next video uh, on the outgoing incoming EDC. Big loser, as you heard the parts falling there in a minute ago, is the Boker Magnum. This thing has really come apart. Uh, another thing that has just come to light since the review part of it is that the liner lock, if the blade has been put into a certain position, will no longer hold. It does hold. In, to the torque side, but the other side just lets it go. So big loser for the medium sized clip knives. Now as far as Machetes go, Gerber, you're the big loser on this one over here. And uh, what can I tell you? The winner is the Golock Machete, True Machete. They are the same price point. This is a true and proven piece of steel here. Martindale uh, built this thing for the British forces and uh, after uh, myself doing a lifetime testing on this, I still like this machete more than any other machete I've ever come across. So that'll be it for the EDC coverage here for today, winners and losers. Uh, only one thing here left to do and I believe it's Chris Wanda. You uh, pop this up here on Ronan Blades here not too long ago, I believe. Uh, here's my 1980, it's 79 or 80 because uh, Christmas 79 or April 1980, I purchased this thing for myself, can't remember when, a long time ago. And uh, this is possibly one of Sherry's best knives ever built, bar none. And uh, this is a knife that I'm going to be passing on to my sons and uh, let them fight over who gets it and if you're looking for one of these things here good luck because i don't think everybody anybody's going to give them up for at this particular point in time now uh <clears throat> biggest disappointment as far as the show is concerned is the fact that our, our relationship with ronan blades here came to somewhat of an abrupt end and uh which you know it kind of hurt our feelings a little bit because uh, the fact that we really wanted to work with uh, some Falcon even knives. Now, uh, that being said, one door closes, many doors open up. I'm currently talking to Falcon even here in Canada to try to make that happen. And also here, probably second quarter, we're going to have a great big announcement coming up here. And uh, I'll save that for then. I've got an EDC coming up right after this one. We're going to shoot it right after this one. So thanks for joining, and uh, please, I was made to feel bad because I don't have enough subscribers. That's one of the holdbacks of, of being able to do other people's uh, uh, you know, materials or properties or whatever. But I need you to get down over here and please subscribe. Uh, you know, this is a variety of shows. You're going to see a variety of things. It's not just going to be knives. But I do have some gun videos coming up. We've got knife videos coming up. I've got, uh, you know, as soon as the weather breaks, it's currently minus 34 out there. So we're going to be a little while on that. So we'll be doing some inside shows. But join me for the next uh, upcoming video. It's going to be on the 2014 EDC. Thanks for joining. See you on the EDC one. Bye-bye now.